And I've had some great conversations with a number of premiers, including Premier Ford. Uh, we're all very much on the same page. There is a need for more money. There is a need uh, for more delivery of results. He went on to hint that more health care funding news is coming. So naturally, David Cochran has the scoop on that. So David, it's been a very public fight between the federal government and the premiers, but clearly something's changed. Yeah, Adrian, the mood is much more positive, both privately and publicly, to the point now that sources at both levels say the framework for an agreement is taking shape. And the broad outline is an across-the-board increase in the Canada health transfer, not the $28 billion a year the premiers wanted, but there will be a jump, plus a series of one-on-one -on -one side deals with provinces and territories to address specific issues with their health systems. They still need to finalize the money, they still need to finalize the fine print, but there is an emerging consensus on the overall framework, which which is very much in line with what Ottawa has been pushing from day one. So the federal government, uh, I gather, wanted to attach condition strings, obviously, to any new money. What's happened to those? Well, those were loaded terms, right? So those have evolved into what will be called shared priorities. A more acceptable term for the premiers, but as we've said, not an actual change from what Ottawa has been insisting on from day one. And those shared priorities are where most of the new money will go, medical backlogs, access to primary care, long-term care and home care, mental health and health data. Those are the pressure points across all provincial health systems. Okay, so given all that, what happens now? Well, the premiers are looking at dates in February for a meeting here in Ottawa, February 9th and 10th or the 12th and 13th. There's hope, there's enough progress between now and then that the Prime Minister will join them for that sit-down and finally end these negotiations. But there's a clear recognition the Prime Minister won't join the premiers unless a deal is at hand which includes meaningful health reform. So there's progress, but still a lot of work to do in the coming weeks. But with federal and provincial budgets coming fast, Adrian, there's extra motivation to get this done. Indeed. David Cochran in Ottawa, thank you. Thank you.